Hands asking for beating. He never pedally wears with that attitude. I don't think I would go for either one of those, so I think we just go for merchandising here. Alright, let's do it. Get moving. Chill axe, dude. What's the story? So, we're gonna swap that weapon. Can't afford to stay And swap out. that hat. Ooh, do I want that to be visible? I do have them set to be turned off in dialogue. Actually, no, that's not true. There you go. Hide your in dialogue. You can, it can be visible the rest of the time. Give up now. Yes, I know charisma modifier affects the thing. Um, here's the thing. Her charisma is only 13 anyway. Even this is with the plus five. I've got a long road ahead. So they both have a plus one. So it does it doesn't matter really for for price wise stuff over here. I mean, unless there's something else, unless it uses a skill. Oh, there's another merchant over here. Oh, this is the uh, the Zent merchant. I never learned the words. Respect. Oh man, we've like respect everyone like 15 times. I love respecting. New face come to bask in the light of the absolute. Oh, floaty thing. How can I be of service, true soul? We, did we not meet? Yeah, I was gonna say, we've met before at the goblin camp. Of course. Just before some godless lunatic purged Maybe I shouldn't have brought it up. Every innocent soul. A pity neither of us saw what happened. You can trust the Zants to be discreet. Mm -mm. Yeah, don't don't question it, Dell. Oh, we really can't just gloss this over? I guess we could be funny and say this. Hmm. Ah, careful. That sounds like an accusation. I guess this is the most, like, let's keep it on the DL option. The guilty here hears blame in every breath. But you're among friends here, true soul. <laughs> I like her. Look around. All manner of beasties united against the enemies of the absolute. Quite a god to bring them all together. And quite a fool who draw their ire. Hmm? Yes, I completely agree. It was unconcerned for my safety. Drop the act. What are you actually doing here? Rather quick to find your faith. In, in, in. You almost sound concerned about safety. I'm going to poke it a little bit more. More concerned that your business might be bad for my business. So don't go kicking the hive while there's still some honey to be hive. had. Hive. All right. Woo, purple. Sharpened snare cuirass. Medium armor. Add your dexterity modifier to your armor class. Okay, so it lets you use your full dexterity. But it doesn't have, like, it's not a plus one or a plus two bait built in. Sharpen star creatures a disadvantage on saving throws when resisting your attack spells and inflict restraint. Yeah, I don't, I mean, there's some cool stuff you can do with it. We're not going to go over it. Gloves are crushing. Wear gains plus one bonus to unarmed attack rolls. We're not doing unarmed attack on any of our characters, but that is really good. Eternal devotion. Recite your oath to gain, regain one channel. Of, okay, so let's paladins regain an oath charge. There's a lot of really solid plus two armor over here. Let me just do a little check of the party. Dell is wearing the scale mail plus two already. So that's gonna be pretty good. All right, cause these two are heavy and there's another plus two. Uh, you've got the end mind adamantine, which is pretty decent. It doesn't have the plus two built into it. So theoretically we could get more AC, but I think it's gonna be fine. You're of course not wearing proper armor and you've got the Yuanti scale mail. Uh, which lets us add up to plus, uh, well, it lets us get our full dexterity modifier, um, which is nice. And because he's got like, I think he's got a 16 dexterity. I'm not convinced we're buying any of that gear. The thunder deals thunder damage. Yeah. There's plus one gear over here. No, I think that's fine. We will, uh, we will buy your potions though. I skipped the blue weapons. Oh, okay. Enemies disadvantage, dragon breath. I mean, it's plus two. It's got draconic. That's cool. Blooded great axe. Well, fifty percent hit points or less. Okay. Monster shell glaive. Yeah, but we're not going to use this on any of our people. Never miss her. Oh, I remember this one. Yeah, so this is a crossbow that does force damage instead of physical damage. Um, force damage, not a lot of things resistance to force damage, which is pretty nice. Gives you casting a magic missile as well, which is great. Do we want to consider that for Asterian?
So his current weapon is a plus two. So it has plus one extra to hit, which is nice and gives us resistance fire and cold and lets us self haste. Oh, it's a hand crossbow as well, so we could dual wield. What I could do, what I could do is buy this and just bank it for now in case we decide to swap Asterion back over to dual weapons, which would probably mean um, when we hit level three rogue again with Asterion, we'd go thief as opposed to assassin. Right now, my plan is to go assassin with a single wet best weapon. Um, so I don't think I'm going to go for it, but it is very cool. I will give it that. Maybe Rose is going to survive this and we'll see her again in Act 3. Well, she'll probably have different stuff. I think I'm going to be fine with this. An honor. True so. Okay. All righty. So do we wander around a little bit more or do we go into the main room immediately just to These are our allies, poke a little bit? Hmm. Big lady. Uh... Luffy now theater, uh, first time chatter maybe come with the raid. We have a very strict no spoiler policy, including for future items. I, need to I don't want to know about any future items nice. because that means when I run into the item, I'm not going to be as excited, right? But you didn't actually spoil what it is. So that's okay. But I, I realize I should have said that out loud for the, the new people joining in. For a moment, you do hear it. Flesh sliding on stone, like a living being extending through the walls. I don't know what this is. Something in the walls, what is it? Big! In walls above! Maybe. Speaking of big, what's she doing later? Del I mean, Del basically likes all the ladies, but he clearly likes all the big ladies. But big band! Not allowed to pet nose! You find meat? You shall. It's a date. Mm -hmm. A door over here. A door over there. The back of the castle. Asmi areas. A little walkway there. There's nothing. Nothing's highlighting to show that the wall is breakable or anything like that. This is the spot that's marked on that map. What map? What spot? There's hidden treasure that we know about from someone from reading things um, from reading things in Rethwin Village, but I thought it was in the basement. I'm holding Alt. Nothing's highlighting. Going around the outside. Oh, I got animal. Speak with animals. Yep. Good. These are the stalking grounds of Steel Claw. Convo's best convos. Tread lightly. Fortunately for you, the slithering vermin I hunt is my attention. For now. Something vermin they're called tadpoles. Murder every single one. Oh, are you? But I want I want them for me. Dell is gonna eat all the tadpoles. Convince them not to go after them. Sorry, your name is Steel Claw? I mean, that's a good name. I don't know why I'd question that. You know what? Let's start with this and then see what happens. I'm sorry, your name is Steel Claw. It is a name I earn through bloodshed and death. Unfortunately, the more ignorant here refuse to use it. Fluffers, they call me. Idiots. Sorry, I'll try to refer to you by your Jellico name. Um, I'm going to say this. Parasites are dangerous. Don't go near them. Do not push your own cowardice upon me. I bear lapping waters and leaking ships to find this prey. I butchered many and will butcher many more. But this one, this one I toy with. I slice. I tear, and when the time is right, I will bite its head off. There's a there's a dead mine worm near it. The tadpole's dead, right? You're a little bit intense. Now, how boring! Sure. Oh, ooh. Hold on, I'm going with, th with four. How boring! Surely you can be a bit more creative. Your mocking tone is a mistake. Oh. Your first and last. Um, don't attack me. You clearly yearn for death. No, no. 
A wish I am happy to oblige. Oh. Sleep with one eye open. Okay, I was worried it was gonna attack and I didn't want to fight Furnace a cat. One. I love the threat. Also, I literally only have one eye, so hopefully I don't lose another one. There's a cat hole. Wait, I got inspiration? Who? Who got the inspiration? It's not, um, it's not always at the top either. Like the latest one, I don't know what the ordering is. Carlac did. Oh, it was in, the... there we go. Mutual respect, thank you. Carlac, right here. Meet the tadpole hunting cat. Okay. Should I shapeshift and go in the cat hole? I, of course I should. Nope, I didn't want to pick that up. Anything of use? Of course not locked. All right, hang on. I'm gonna just waste a wild shape charge here, but I have to know. Oh. Okay, so not actually the most useful thing in the universe, but good to know. And drop right away because I want Del to be still in conversations. Ah. Oh, there was an X near the ballista. Okay, let me take a look. There's another vendor, Arage. That's sleep. Oh, there was this X. Maybe that X marks the spot. Oh, does Mage Hand go through those little holes? Oh, that would be quite cool. Okay, it's an exploration. Maybe I should just dig. Nothing interesting buried here. Nothing X interesting buried X here. X does not... Nothing. X does not mark the spot. Nothing. There's nothing to attack. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, well. Here, I want to I wanna pop back in. I know there's some stuff back here, but I'm sure we'll get to it. I kind of just want to go through the main conversation now and see what's what. Where do you hail from? Valley. Then the dreams came. My brothers had the dreams too. Same as me. But they wouldn't admit it. The Absolute calls us all for her design. Your family will answer. I wonder if any of these people are people we've seen before. What's on the other side? Some goblins here. There's an ability to get a high ground. I know I'm still not going to the main room, but... Ooh, that is creepy. Okay, I can get lots of food. If we're worried about, like, supplies, we can do that, but I think we're good. Oh my. I succeeded on a perception check. Shoot, I didn't notice what glowed. Yeah, I don't know what glowed. Let's have a chat with uh, Lincella here, see what she's doing with the... Uh... Oh, this is the kitchen! With the weird things in the walls! And the meat for the ogre. A spoon to stir the soup, Barnabas. Forget the axe, my darling. Oh, you look great and excellent voice. I love that she's trying to train the mind-controlled gnolls to cook. Now, how can I help you? Oh, the slimy thing in the previous room, maybe. Um, Barnabas? I've shown Barnabas a kinder way. Oh yes, the kinder, the kinder gentler absolute. Is only fitting. That is the gift the absolute gave me when I stood before her. To rewrite the lives of her faithful. Make them believe there's something better. Ah! Thought the absolute accepted us as we are. You've actually stood before the absolute? I have. It is one thing to hear her voice, quite another to feel the power she can grant. Again, you succeed in perception check. Observe. Well, no, I did not. Exactly. Barnabas, sweetie, come 
I'm so what a good boy you are. What would you like him to do? Uh You decide. How about a dance? Nothing keep your sick games to yourself. Uh, you decide. The prayer, I think. Barnabas struggles with civilized speech, but he's been practicing. You feel her will surge outwards and envelop the creature, inexorable as the tide. <laughs> Barney doesn't like it. No, Barnabas. Uh oh. We talked about this. Wisdom, sever her control once and for all. Oh, reinforce her efforts with your own. Things you're not as commanding as you think. Uh, I kind of want option one. I mean, again, we want to be here undercover, but if things can just accidentally go bad for followers of the absolute, that seems like a good thing, right? Yes! For science! Asterion and Karlak. Asterion approved of me doing something! Taught beneath the blade, the connections. Hey, Mr. Danish Butter, thanks for the reset. Snaps. No! Barnabas. Darling. <laughs> no! No one's gonna be pissed! There's a parasite in that core. All trace of restraint is gone. Barnabas has tasted blood and wants more. As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. Authority. Easy, afraid you, I'm a friend. Dare it, I try you. I don't think I want to use up my uh, Mind Flare power yet, because I'm assuming there's going to be some other good options for it in here. Um, I don't mind fighting it. But I'm worried that that might bring more attention to me. I wonder if we can convince them to be friends. We're really good at persuasion. I'm just thinking about, like, you know doing the, the bigger dog thing. Arr. But maybe we can actually get a buddy through this? I don't expect it. They're freaking gnolls. You like skip something here? You think so? I don't know. I mean, maybe. I don't know. Um, saying these out loud, because I wouldn't want her to hear number one. Yeah, that's true. There might be witnesses for number one. I'm going to go with two. Again, we're playing a role. Our role here is going to do this. At least for now. I mean, we'll be back and forth. We can do things on the sly, yeah, but there might be witnesses. There are other gnolls. The beast sizes you up, then turns away to easier prey. The kitchen's rich stock of unguarded meat and a warm patch by the fire. Oh, don't eat all the meat. I promise them to the ogre lady. <laughs> Charlatan Pied Piper. Um, there's some theft available. Careful, I bind. On tippy -tip. Okay, uh, we're st I'm still, I should maybe spend some more now. I was um, saving the uh, tadpoles for when we unlock like some later stuff, but I should probably, should get ability drain. I mean, and again, Dell is gonna eat all of them even if it doesn't make any sense. I'm gonna pick up more passives. You know, let's pick Charm. It's a passive. Charm an enemy that attacks you, preventing them from attacking you until the next turn. Well, nor okay, if I go back to being in, like, bear form all the time, I want them to attack me, in theory. Although this helps to spread out the damage, right? They've attacked me once, and hopefully they don't just keep attacking me back to back to back. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Dell's going to continue to make terrible choices and eat all the worms. Like, shield the thralls. Conjure a volatile shield around yourself or an ally, granting the target 10 temp HP. Oh, until long rest. Oh, that is quite good. Okay. So let's get... We'll pick up transfuse health. We'll grab that. Oh, my poor brain! And then, yeah, we can use this. 
Oh, including myself. Oh, that's quite good. Neat. All right. Do, do, do. Okay, hold on. We're gonna see Must if there was. Way. Maybe it was highlighting this. We weren't sure. The, the perception. Apparently, I can poke the mucus. Ooh, something slimy seems to be dripping from the rafters above. Uh huh. I'm assuming this is what Mig was talking about. Oh, I should speak hello, up. other vendor. That smells. Araj Oblodra. Trader in blood and the sanguineous arts. It is a pleasure to stand before a true soul and your pale companion. Oh! I'd like to offer my services, if you're willing. I mean, you know Delores. He's going to be willing. Um, so, is she a vampire? Well, um, I, first of all, I, of course I'm listening. But plainly, I'd like your blood. A vial of true soul's blood, specifically. With one drop, I can brew a rather potent potion for you. The rest, I keep for myself. I mean, classically, having a sample of someone's blood is a good way to, like, control them via magic and things like that. Um... So, first of all, what kind of potion is this? No idea, but it will be unique to you. Huh. Your blood essence and the absolute's blessing. Do you recognize the house name? We can learn exactly Ovaladra? what that No, I don't. Together. Is it from books mm -hmm. or is it from previous Baldur's Gates? No, I don't know the house name. Please enlighten me. So what are you going to do with the blood you keep? Research, naturally. A little experimentation, perhaps. I have an innate curiosity for all things sanguine. House from the Drids books. Ah, uh, Okay. I have read um, a couple of the Drizzit trilogies, but it's been a long time. I mean, it's not, this sounds like a, a terrible idea. Let's do it. Just a little prick and it's all over. Hey, listen, I don't know what you've heard, but, oh, never mind. Okay. There we are. All of your very best traits in a bottle. I mean, how can Use I say no? Well. Although perhaps there's one more thing we could do. Yeah, what's all this about Asterion? Your friend. He's a vampire, no? Or one of their spawn, at least. Oh, don't worry. We're all friends under the absolute. I won't bite. Oh, I'd prefer if you did. I assume he belongs to you? Well, maybe I belong to him. I'm just... <clears throat> um... Um... Yes, all mine. Well, I hope you don't mind sharing him for just a minute. I'm surprised I didn't get any reaction from Asterion. Spawn. <laughs> Astarian, but, but hold on. Good. Now, Astarian. She... I've dreamt of being bitten She's by a Twihard. since I was a young girl. Or whatever. Uh, I don't know what the, a proper name is for vampire well, fandom in general, bitten. which I should to know because I'm one of them. Blood slipping away. To dance on the edge between life and death. Oh, I like her. Yes, I want it. I'll even compensate you. A potion of legendary power that forever increases the strength of the one- I'm sorry, what? It. It's not for sale, but it's yours. What? If you bite me. I Sarah, do it. No, no, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Excuse me? This is a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity, and you're screaming. Asterion, I will mind-worm you. I gave you my answer. Uh, can't you talk some sense into your obstinate charge? Why does- hold on. Why doesn't he want to bite her? It's like... I mean, she's not actually asking to be killed. She's just... Yeah, I, listen, I'm surprised. Asterion, I thought you'd jump at a chance like this. I'm sorry, but could you excuse us a moment? Yeah, let's have a little chat. Are you actually asking me to do this? Trading me for some, some, some potion? Because there's something wrong with her blood. Oh! I can smell it from here. It's rank. Oh! 
What do you mean? What's wrong with her blood? I can't say. It just smells wrong. Unnatural. Drinking it wouldn't kill me. But it would She'd been be ingesting possible. vervain? 